And I welcome you back to Radio Craft. I am the Radio Man 03. You and I, we are playing Minecraft on the Xbox 360. Welcome aboard. Good to have you here at White Castle. Hmm, that city pack. Pretty sweet, huh? That city texture pack. That is a beauty. This did not look good <laughs> in that texture pack with that, uh, that stone look, that sandstone uh, crushed kind of a cobble look to it almost like this stone right here but brown it didn't it looked okay but it would not be my first choice in, in a building material i want to welcome you back to radio craft it is good to have you along uh we are going to uh finish out this room we are actually putting the fireplace into this room oh my gosh oh my gosh Die! Holy cow, that's a durable creeper. Jeez. <laughs> There's a start, huh? What was I saying? We are building the fireplace in here. And we're going to get this installed today. We're going to get this room decked out. I asked for suggestions. I got one. I got one suggestion, and I like it. Look at this guy here, too. Whew. I'm going to have to deal with that, that situation as well. Uh, to do, turn this into a music room and I thought okay yeah we'll put uh, the suggestion was we'll put a jukebox in with a couple of note box speakers and then my other idea for the room too is we'll put item frames up with armor and swords and axes and stuff on it and make it just sort of a I don't know a trophy room or something like that and I think that's what that will be like a just a, a war room a war room where we go think about the battles we've had like that one that we just experienced just now just now Oh, I want to run this chimney up and out of here, uh, way up, so that it's visible above ground. And we're going to go right through the mountain, basically. We're just going to keep on going up with these as high as we can go. Well, not as high as we can go, but, you know, outside. <laughs> not that high. Bump, bump, bump. This is a seven. Seven blocks across. Like so. And we're going to be going, yeah, straight up with this. So this is going to be the fireplace right here. No, 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 no. Come on. This will go straight up. And I don't know how many blocks up we'll go. We'll go up, we'll go up quite a ways, I believe. And then um, I'll come back and uh, I'll decide how high up we're going to go. And then uh, we'll, we'll build it up and we'll get this fireplace put in. Like I said, we'll finish this room today. We'll get this room all put together today. It'll be all dressed out, and we can call it a done project. So stick around. Okay, we got this kind of hollowed out a little bit. Let's just follow this building up, and we'll see where we want to go with it. Um, I'm making kind of a mistake right here. Hmm. I don't think I want this to come. Yeah, this has to come up too as well. Yeah, never mind. Never mind. Our circle's mostly on the back side of this, of course on the sides like so so I had a rare pri privilege the other day um, actually I get I get the privilege quite a bit to talk to some really neat people I do a talk show where I work um, and some of you know that I do that's what I do for a living I'm on the radio for a living that's what I do in a smaller uh, small market area anyways I got to do this uh, really interesting talk show with this uh, she was 11 and she was chosen uh, nationally to participate in the extreme Mustang makeover and basically this girl this young girl 11 years old has to uh, she has a Mustang a wild Mustang that was captured and she has about, uh, what is it? I think it's 90 days, 90 days to teach it as much as she can and get the, uh, get the horse trainable. She doesn't have to break it to where she can ride it, but she does have to be able to, uh, I guess for her division would be to, to be able to lead the animal without it yanking back. Oh, look at that, a delicious apple. What? Give me that apple. Uh, and, oh, man, doggone it. I hate it when that happens. Anyway, she has about 100 days, and there's just a few things. There's some things she has to teach the horse. Anyways, it's a it's a difficult competition. It really is. I mean, think about it. You're a wild animal, you know. Uh, it's quite a feat to take on. But anyways, I thought that was a very impressive 11-year-old. Uh, that was the very first uh, interview I'd done with a, a young person. 
uh, on camera and then on the radio as well. And she did a marvelous, marvelous job uh, in the interview. She was just really great. Uh, spoke well and um, did a nice job about talking about how excited she was about being able to do this. But uh, I thought it was really cool that this 11-year-old uh, girl is working so hard for this Mustang horse. You know, Mustangs kind of frowned upon. And uh, they compete with ranchers and stuff like that. So, you know, Mustangs get rounded up on a regular basis and uh, they go bye-bye. They go bye-bye. It's not always a good place. So she has one. She adopted it. And I think that's pretty cool. And then uh, I did two horse interviews, actually, which is kind of unusual. I don't know that I've done quite so many interviews regarding horses. But this other gal uh, from the U.S., she is going to ride a horse from my state back to her state, from Arizona to Wisconsin. And it's a 2,200-mile ride, and she's going to ride it on horseback all the way there. That is amazing. It's going to take something like six months to accomplish. We need to get some stuff out of here. A six-month ride. That is just absolutely amazing. And she's going to raise uh, money for a couple of uh, very worthwhile causes. One is for Make-A-Wish, a child. She's going to actually fulfill a child's wish. She has to raise uh, $10,000 for the Make-A-Wish. And then um, she's also raising money for a horse rescue operation. And uh, that's pretty cool. So she's hoping to raise about $40,000. And I think she can do it. But can you imagine horseback for that long of a distance? I just uh, I can't imagine it. It's something like she'll be able to travel 20 miles a day. That's it. 20 miles a day. Total of three horses with her. That's amazing. Absolutely amazing. But, uh, yeah, if she does that, it's going to be really, really, really cool. Let's get this out of here. If I plant this, is it going to pop up and get in my way? There's those seeds again. What is up with these seeds? There they are again. They're, they're back in my inventory. I can't get rid of them. <laughs> so anyways, just, uh, you know, kudos to those people for the, the marvelous things that they are doing. I think it's really, really cool. I always say good things happen to good people. So I, I interviewed two people that were very, very good people. And uh, I enjoyed it. And I thought I'd share it with you a little bit. Uh, just a basic about their story. Not getting into too, too much detail, of course. But uh, yeah, very cool. Okay, we're coming along with the chimney just fine. Took me a little while to get in the groove. But here we are. We're doing all right. I think I, think I want to come up at least two more to start. Let's see what it looks like from a distance. Hmm, especially this... Did I only grab one stack of that? Jeez. Alright, let's go get another stack. Come on. Oh, boy. My head just is not here. That's all there is to it. Doing the best I can. I'm doing the best I can. We'll get this project done. Don't you worry. We'll get it done. No worries. I would like it to stop raining, is what I would like. Come on, let me in here. <laughs> I'm just having a heck of a time, ain't I? Heck of a time. Heck of a time! It's going to be a very big fireplace, but the way I see this... the You know, White Castle's pretty sizable structure, so let, let's, let's imagine this thing heating this, uh, this establishment, this one fireplace. It would have to put off some serious heat to get... Uh, get things going in here so yeah I, I thought you know a larger fireplace would be pretty awesome is it nighttime yet it's almost nighttime let's sleep and then we will finish up the project in the sunshine okay we're back let's take a look at this and see how it looks I'm hoping it's not going to be too big for the wall it's sitting next to let's go see what we think of it I think it's going to be okay there's no seeds. I got them back again. Ah, <laughs> oh, seeds. <laughs> oh, man, that is funny. So many seeds. Uh, that doesn't really give us a good look at it, does it? I'm, what I'm really hoping, too, is that the back side of it is kind of cut into that mountain a little bit, so it's not completely exposed. Yeah, see the way it sits into the ground? I like that. We'll probably clear a little dirt away from the side of the building. Um... Hmm. I feel like we could actually maybe go a couple more. A couple more up with that. Big old smokestack next to the uh, White Castle. 
I think so. <laughs> Maybe you wouldn't be able to stay in that room right there. It'd be so, so hot in that room. Right next to that fireplace, you wouldn't be able to stand the heat. If it's heating this whole place, oh my god, that room has got to be like a furnace. <laughs> That's a huge fireplace. We'll close it in a little bit, though, too. We'll close it in just a little bit. All my dirt pillars, I think, yeah. No, you know what? Let's not go any higher with it. Let's let's just leave it the way, where it is. I think we're good right where it is. I want to go... Well, let me show you. Let me show you what I got in mind here. Um, <laughs> I'm wanting to do... <laughs> this is really going to... I wonder if this is going to square it off too much. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's see what happens when I do this here. Come on, give it to me. Oh, right. there we go. And then right here. Right here. I wonder if that's going to square that off too much. I don't know. Let's see if we can get a couple more here and take a look at it and see. I'm thinking about doing this all the way around and then putting... Let's put some of these down too just to see. We'll go back out to where we just were and take a look back at it and see what we think. These are going to go all along here basically. Yeah, let's go and, uh, into Pearl over here. Yeah, that'll be a nice, simple smokestack. I wonder if I should taper it in a little bit. Hmm, no. No, it's good. It's good just the way it is. Yeah, okay. No problem there. We're going to do that just the way it is. We'll get that finished up and take a look at how that looks at the very end. All right. I think it looks good. I think it looks good on the side of the building. That works for me. It's a big smokestack, so... Hmm. We're going to have to have some, some definite some fire in there. Something going on inside that fireplace. So, let's get the uh, another rack going, and we'll figure out how we want the inside of the fireplace to look now that we have the outside figured out. It works really well right here, I think. I'm going to take this and this and this out. And that one right there, too. There we go. There's a little bit more of it showing, and you can see that it goes up against the wall of the building there. So I think that's how I want to go with that. Let's get this dirt out of here. There we go. Beautiful. Yeah. Perfect. That works for me. Adds a little more structure to White Castle now. Got that big old stack on it there. You know, it's over-exaggerated, but that's okay. That's just fine. Uh, let's go in here. Let's get this out of here. I thought for sure we are going to be able to get all that down right away. More. We'll just be careful now. We'll just go all the way up. All right, there we go. All right, design for the fireplace. Hmm. <laughs> I know something like this is going to go in here like that. It's going to be recessed into that hole, that entire hole back there. But I want uh, enough space right here for us to be able to walk up and not be actually in it. We're going to make all of this. How big is our fire pit going to be? Let's go like this. Yeah, just like that. Let's take it down one more. Let's fill this up with the uh, end stone as well. Okay. Mm -hmm. God, there's not much else to do, really. We just need to get that fire going in there. So what about the border, though? What about inside here? No wood. We don't want the wood catching fire. Um, let's do something like this. 
throw a different block in here real quick. There we go. Maybe these three here. Yes. Okay, yeah. Okay, I like that. Uh, the nether rack will go in there. Hmm. What about right in here though? Right along this edge, just the just the first layer up. What about uh what about doing something like this? Or we can actually do it this way too. <laughs> Almost looks like a, a couch. Come on in, sit down. Yeah, um, I think I prefer the way the other two are set up. There we go. <laughs> Come and sit in the inferno. There we go. Yes. Let's do that. Let's get some netherrack and put it up there and see what, uh, let's light it up. See how it looks. Quick sip of, sip of coffee there. Oh, there we go. Better. All better. Uh, let's take a rest. Get the sun to come up real quick. Ooh, while we're at it, let's go ahead and take our jute box with us. I think I'll put another chest here. Um, we'll take the jute box down there. We have, uh, we've got way too much stuff in the inventory. We don't have room for the jute box even. Um, another rack. Another rack and the flint and steel is what we need. Flint and steel in here? No. Do I have a flint and steel in here? Uh, no, I don't. Huh. I'll be darn. Would have sworn I'd have one. Uh, let's take that out for now. Flint and steel. Did I not put the iron in here? Did I just stick it right back in here? Jeez. Alright. Let's get on track here, right? Um, yeah, let's put the iron back. There we go. Um, gosh, the rest of the stuff I don't want to drop because I'm coming up with new things to do. I don't want to lose the materials and have to come all the way back up here for them again. Throw the gravel right there. I th think we're done with the bricks. I'm pretty sure we're done with those. There's some more dirt. Always more dirt coming. Ooh, we got glass. Hmm. Let's move that down here a little bit. And we've got some cobble we can get rid of. Come on. Uh, cobble, cobble. Okay, now no blocks, if I'm not mistaken, are made out of wood and redstone. Wood and redstone. Need like some wood and I think one of those. So I think nope, we're gonna need two, two of these. So we want two note blocks. All right, and note blocks are they in the decorative? Electrical. There we are. There we go. Okay. This suggestion was given to me by Produce Warrior with the uh, speakers and the radio, and we need the nether rack. Tell me I got some in here. Oh, I sure do. Okay, let's, uh, let's just grab half of that for the heck of it. Ooh, and one more thing. Yep, there we go. All right, I think we've got everything we need now. Let's see. We're going to have to get the item frames and the records and stuff like that. Well, maybe we'll leave the records there, but we do need to put item frames up with uh, some different uh, items in them. <laughs> That'll work. Yeah, we'll put items in the item frame. That's a great idea. Yeah, White Castle looks good, I think. Um, <laughs> let's go ahead and figure out where we want the, the jukebox. I believe we're going to want the jukebox. Oh, you know what? We could do kind of a corner unit like this. And like that. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, there we go. We'll put the jukebox in the corner there. Um, let's see what we've got going on with this right now without doing anything else just yet. Let's light it up and see what it looks like. Hmm. 
<laughs> Let's see here. Yeah. I was thinking we needed more fire, but I don't know that we need more fire. I don't know about that. Hmm. Let's move this block and this block. Okay, that looks pretty sharp. What do we got on here? Spider. Slabs. You tracking me? There we go. I like, I, I meant to do that since the beginning of the video. <laughs> That's been kind of driving me crazy. Um, hmm, if we do this. Oh, yeah, that looks good. That looks good. I like that. Okay, there's our, our big fireplace. I was thinking about putting some nether rack up around the top, around the edge, and setting it on fire so this smoke will drift out the stack. I think I might want to try that and see if that works. Okay, and then we need we need item frames for our trophy room. I like that. I think that looks good. It's really, really very, very basic, right? We'll do something like that right there, too. Hmm. Yeah. That works. That's fine with me. I like that. We can see the brown as we come in like that right ahead of us. And we're good to go here. Yeah, I like that. Okay, let's get let's get our uh, item frames. We need, uh, I don't know, what, maybe... Let's get ten of them. Let's make ten item frames, and then we'll put ten items down there, and then we'll add to it as we go. Yeah, that sounds like a plan to me. Let's get this stuff put away. Looks like we've got a door freaking out there. Um, actually, these should not go in here. These should go right in here with the iron. There we go. Uh, glass panes. Done. Don't need them. Ha! Huh, we didn't mind up using that at all. Uh, there's our end stone. End stone. We're almost out of that. Another rack. Uh, stone slabs. Oh, you know what? Let's take that with us, though. We'll try that roof idea out. I will try to remember to do that. And let's leave the wood items in here. Yeah, let's go with that right there. Okay, item frames. Oh, looks like we're making six of them. <laughs> we are making six item frames, and we're putting those up to see what we think of those sticks. I think I'm going to need a lot of sticks for this. If I'm not mistaken, it's I think it's eight sticks. Uh, decorative... Yeah. There we go. Six of those, and you know what? I think I think we've got some iron tools. I would actually prefer some iron down there on the walls as opposed to. I like the iron and how it looks. I really do. Um, we do have an iron pick and an iron sword. You know what? We can put the uh, definitely put a power one bow down there. Uh, the helmet. What's that? One, two, three, four. I've got room for two more things. Hmm. How about a diamond? How about a, one diamond down there? Yeah. And. Hmm. <laughs> oh. I think we have what we need to make it. How about an Eye of Ender? An Eye of Ender in a frame. Yes, I think that would be good. Whoops, wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. Yes, the blaze powder is downstairs. It is in our potion room. And we have, I think, I've got Ender Pearls on me, so I believe we have everything we need. Let's take a few of those. Let's make a few Eyes of Ender. Is it here? There we go. Let's just make one. Beautiful. Alright. Let's hang some stuff up in our trophy room here. Um, 
Hmm. How about above the fireplace? We place... That is the most important tool in Minecraft. I think that's the most important tool, I would say. Uh, let's see. Let's go like that. And like that. And then... Something like that. Yeah. Okay. I have Ender. Where are you going to go? Right up here. Right up here. Anytime we're coming out, we will see the mighty Eye of Ender. Indeed. All right. And... Hmm. <laughs> Should probably put a record right there, huh? Let's see here. We're going to have to put one there and one there, and then we'll have to do the same thing on the other side of the room. What do we want here? I think the, sh the helmet. And then maybe the bow next to it, right? The bow. Yeah, let's do the bow. And we'll turn it like that. No. There. I guess, yeah, just like that. We'll leave it just like that. I like that. And then over here, maybe we could put a pair of boots, iron boots, and um, something else. We were going to put a diamond up, weren't we? Hmm. Well, maybe we will, maybe we won't. I don't know. I don't know. We're going to need a couple of chairs in here. What I should do is give Variety 3 to come in here and do it. Let's let's put a chair right here. Uh, I got some oak on me, don't I? Let's see here. Would this Does this work like this? <laughs> it does not look like a chair. There's not a chair. <laughs> Gosh, maybe that's something I should have Variety 3 do. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Does it have a oak slab, maybe, or something like that I could just throw in between there? Oak slab, there we go. Like something like that. Just put that there. Oh, how about... Uh, there we go, some kind of a stand. Yeah, you put something on there. And let's go... Hmm. We'll put a little shelf over on this side here. I have to take out the wool the old-fashioned way. Punch it right out of the ground. Let's go like that. And we'll make the tables oak so that they stand out a little bit from the wall. They don't blend in with everything else. Um, where's my wool? There it is. Bump. Yeah, very cool. Very cool. Got our music. Little table there to set stuff on. We, we need a chair, though, huh? I'll have Variety 3 put a chair in for us right around in here. We'll have a little chair to sit in. I'm not sure what to do about the chair. I'll have to have her come in and do that. There was probably an abrupt ending there. I almost forgot to uh, go ahead and light up the fireplace from above. I do want to see what it looks like from up here. Uh, we'll keep the fire below hopefully I don't know if that's gonna catch this wood on fire or not it looks like it might if it uh, well let's uh, you know what I think I'm gonna check and see will it burn the slabs I'm pretty sure it will God knows I've been wrong about a lot of other things though so I'm gonna hang out and watch that burn for a little while and see if the wood catches fire all right, it's been a few minutes, and uh, nothing's caught fire yet. We'll leave it just like that. I'm going to put iron bars and grate this thing in right here. I think that'll work just fine for that, but uh, that's what's going to be up here. You'll never see it. We're never going to be actually inside the fireplace, so it doesn't matter. But uh, I'll put the iron bars in there just so I know they're there, and that building is being held properly. I think you can actually see the smoke coming out of the chimney there for a second. I don't know. I can't tell. Anyways, it's up there. At night, it'll glow, I think, real nice. I think that'll be uh, a good addition. Hey, buddy, what are you doing out here? Looking for a fight? Whack! There we go. Yeah, I think that's a nice little addition. We got our fireplace, we got a trophy room, we have our music room. Nice little uh, fireplace going on at the end of the building there that helps, uh, of 
course, keep the uh, White Castle warm. So I think that looks pretty cool. That is a nice, nice room. Nice addition to uh, White Castle. I hope you agree. I'll get these other item frames up, and that's the last thing we have to do here. And I'll get, like I said, Variety. I'll have her come in and put a chair in, and uh, we'll see what she comes up with. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'm the Radio Man 03, and I will talk to you again next time.